Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video I'm going to show you how you can integrate WooCommerce with HubSpot. First things first, we have to create ourselves an account at WooCommerce.com or log in to our existing account. Once we do that, we will discover the fact that we are not able to integrate uh, uh, or make this integration straight through WooCommerce. So we are going to use third-party app to finish this integration. We are going to use automate.io. I will leave the link in the description underneath this video. And once we are here, let's go and click on integrations and hover over left uh, bottom of our uh, left bottom part of this pop-up window and see all categories. Now we can search from all the integrations that uh, uh, or apps for integration that are available for us. But at the moment, we want to start with the WooCommerce. Once we added WooCommerce, we should add the counterpart, which in our case will be HubSpot. Like this. Uh, on popular, uh, straight away, we are greeted with automate.io popular integration site, and we are able to pick straight away some popular integrations but if you won't be able to find the one that you are looking for keep scrolling down so you can create your own integration just remember on the left side underneath the triggers you really want to start with woocommerce not with hubspot that it's like first in the line on the other hand the other side underneath the actions you want to uh, go with hubspot i'm going with the first options just to show it to you uh, once we've done that, and obviously you can pick, uh, I mean, whichever one that you really want to use, like new product or new subscription, it's up to you, uh, unless it's WooCommerce on let's left side and HubSpot at right side. Once you picked your uh, options, let's click on try it now button. And the last thing we have to do, we have to log in or register to automate.eo website. We can also go and try to use Zapier.com, uh, which is basically a very similar app to Automate. And let's go to the top left corner and click on Create Zap. Once we're in here, it works, as I said, quite the like Automate. So underneath the trigger, we want to go with WooCommerce like this. We have to set up a trigger event, so let's stick with the first options, continue. And now uh, we just have to sign in to the WooCommerce account. On the second action underneath, as you probably thought, we want to go with HubSpot. Like this. Now we have to choose an event. So let's go with the create a deal, for example, continue. And the last thing, we also have to log in to our HubSpot account. So that's about it. Thanks for watching and see you on the next video.